of shoppers without their consent. 12 of the country's most popular shopping malls now under the microscope. After a federal privacy investigation found the mall operator used tiny cameras and facial recognition technology embedded in map kiosks to estimate the ages and genders of shoppers without their knowledge. Well, everybody should be concerned uh, at the level of surveillance technologies that are invading our lives every day, and we don't know that they're happening. The Cadillac Fairview, which owns the Eaton Centre and Sherway Gardens, says it used AVA technology to assess foot traffic, but did not intend to identify shoppers. They say sticker notices were placed on doorways to the mall to notify customers, but regulators say that wasn't fair warning and did not meet the standard for meaningful consent. Even with new signage, really how many people stop to read this fine print on a sign on a door when there's so many people pushing past? It doesn't happen. Uh, what has to happen? People have to become more aware. We have to take it upon ourselves to learn what our rights and our responsibilities are. In a release, the Privacy Commissioner noted the company also used video analytics to collect and analyze sensitive biometric information. The images were deleted, but Privacy Watchdogs say they found the images were being stored in a database by a third party, which Cadillac Fairview says it was not made aware of. In a statement, the company says in part, Cadillac Fairview disabled and removed AVA pilot software more than two years ago when privacy concerns were first raised by the public. We subsequently deactivated directory cameras and numerical representations and associated data have since been deleted. Privacy experts say the issues lie in federal privacy laws that remain outdated and have not kept up with the times. It really hasn't been updated to, to meet today's technology requirements. And it, it leaves everybody in a lurch and it leaves an awful lot of wiggle room for organizations that want to bring in this wonderful, innovative technology, but at everybody's risk. Cadillac Fairview says it does not plan on using these cameras again, but the Federal Privacy Commissioner says they do have concerns over the future plans of this company because they have not committed to ensuring meaningful consent. Melissa Nakavali, City News.